Hi, it is Ai Gang time again. So there are many discussion between me and uh, our Wing Chun friends on the fighting simulator. And uh, what I found out is that uh, many of our Wing Chun friends do not understand what I'm presenting on the fighting simulator. <clears throat> so I like to uh, share with you more in details. Okay. Now, this channel or the paradigm I'm getting into or the era of Wing Chun West I'm getting into is uh, uh, an educational era, okay? And a uh, simulator, be it in engineering training or in flying a jet plane such as the Boeing 747, it is a big part of education. It makes learning easy, it make, it, make it, it make learning and studying things become uh, effective, efficient and can easily gain insight without big price tag or pay big price of it. Okay? Now, I understand uh, many of our Wing Chun friends told me that they, say, well, they just do some light sparring and then they uh, uh, go uh, refine their they are egg with the wooden army, the classical wooden army. Well, it is fine who whatever people like to do, okay? However, the concept of simulations is uh, a much better uh, for education. Why? Because we are using today's technology. You look at people, for example, uh, you can go to YouTube, look at the uh, Boeing 747 flying simulator, okay, where people, real pilots, is going to fly the simulator, test it out in the simulator before they go to the air, okay. And uh, that is a part of uh, today's technology which is really critical, okay. We can do a thing which is uh, cut down the time between one week to months or years with the simulator and thus simulator is a good tool for that and also it keep one to have a, a, a standard, a quality standard okay for example you fly a 747 you cannot say oops I, I, I forgot to learn this, I forgot to learn that you get into the, for, for the uh, uh, 747 Boeing flight simulator, you learn all the, uh, the scenario from uh, takeoff, landing, and all these different cases. So when you go up in the air, even for the first uh, test drive, you already know what to expect and so that you can uh, focus on what is uh, the change might happen okay so that way it can be really really uh, simple to learn and uh, have everybody have a high quality and high standard okay without the similar uh, simulator type of learning and the the the, uh, the scenario like the Boeing 747 it is really low efficiency and, and, and very ineffective okay the sifu might uh, or the instructor or the coach might miss something and you can see that people try an error and might completely missing the whole view you cannot we just cannot put this kind of thing uh, people in as a, 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 a 747 Boeing pilots you're gonna kill people okay the plane will crush if you if, if we're doing those kind of stuff okay now, you can say or argue that, uh, that maybe some genius can do it, so what? 1 out of 10,000, 1 out of 100,000, and one mistake, the whole plane crush, and everybody die. So, you look at it. Which is more dangerous, to, 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 to fly a 747 or to learn simple basic Wing Chun? Okay? And first, Wing Chun wears era. Wing Chun West education as what I propose here. It's going to use 
our technology today, we don't want to change whatever our ancestor designed about Wing Chun Queen or create about Wing Chun. But we're going to use the technology today to make learning more effective <coughs> and everybody have a high standard. And of course, <coughs> like uh, living in Silicon Valley, I know, usually there are four phases of changing people uh, will face. The first is that uh, when people heard about new ideas, they will uh, put objection on it. The second phase, they will go to the seriously against it. <coughs> the third, they are get, getting tired <coughs> because other people have found the benefit of it and they are slowly give up their uh, against or oppositions and start to go with it. The fourth is they see the benefit and they go with it. That's how a paradigm will shift. And this simulator issue will do the same thing. Okay, so like it or not, this is uh, 2017. Like it or not, this is the era of technology. Like it or not, Wing Chun is going to go change this way. Like it or not, the simulator is going to stay and it's going to improve. Today is just this simple stuff. Later, we can put artificial intelligence thing in there to make it an even better simulation. Okay? So, Simulator is good is that we know Wing Chun is about uh, momentum. Okay, we know fighting is about momentum, period. Okay, so with a simulator, a proper uh, agronomic and realistic simulator, we can test out, we can experiment, we can check out the idea for the simple momentum, okay, like strike or anything, simple momentum. And then we can actually, after again the experience and insight with the simple momentum, we can actually synthesize the simple momentum into complex one. Complex momentum where you involve setup and different kind of stuff. Okay? And one, when one go to sparring, one already have this simple momentum and complex momentum, the basic handle. All these scenarios need to be handled, handled. So when they go to sparring, one after this training, one only pay attention to what is needed to pay at the time, which is the change. Okay, because everything changed. Whereas for the basic, one have no longer need to pay attention. Otherwise, if, if one go jump into the sparring without all this training, is one is going to look for 10,000 things there and still missing something and one have no idea what is important, what is not important and how things change and so forth. So the simulator do their job. Also, after, sim after the sparring, if one have some issue, one can go back to simulator and replicate that, that, uh, that, uh, that the issue or that case or that scenario and see in a different speed you can slow down with a very slow speed and see what's going on or go high speed, full force and see you know, what is going on to gain the insight and make the correction or uh, to, to, to improve it. So that's what simulator is for. Same with uh, in the uh, design in the Silicon Valley. One need to use this and it cut down the time for prototyping and so forth. Because right now you're running in the you can see things, you can slow things down, zoom in things, everything, okay? So that's for simulator. Now, not to mention simulator come with a standard, a good standard, because when everybody going doing the same scenario, everybody would learn the same thing. At least the basics the same. This just make a, a simple example for you. We know the full entire Wing Chun uh, quit or writing of uh, in this Wing Chun West, which I propose or I share with you guys, is long coming, short, receive, and uh, close in. That's number one for the short strike. And we know that uh, come, receive, go, escort, and then we know about uh, disengage, trust forward, straightly, okay, linearly, direct, straight, trust forward. 
We know that using dodge to move forward, we know using hard and soft accordingly because this is momentum play. So with this simulator, okay, it's very simple. What can go inside there, okay? Long coming, short receive. So you go here, long coming, short receive, close in. So I can go simulate it. I can close in, you see, I can close in here. Same thing here in the middle, okay? I can close in here. And the difference is I have to take, take care of this hand. Watch out for this arm because I'm close in here. Okay, I'm retracting and closing close for this arm. Or I can actually strike from this side and I actually uh, watch for this arm. Okay, so that is what can, can test it out with the simulator. Well, in the wounded army, you cannot walk this way. You, you cannot walk, walk behind that. You, you cannot do that. It's limited. Okay, now that's the first thing. The second thing is as the come receive goes escort. Okay. So say in front of that, the attack is coming in, I receive it, and at the same time, I escort it up. Okay? Come receive, escort it up. I can catch that. And if I don't understand that, I can stand there, stand here for hours, just keeping thinking, oh, is my leg here? Is proper? Just have a feeling, have a sense. Have understanding, and then one can go fast with the uh, with the momentum and see what happened there. Okay, you cannot do this kind of thing in sparring. Okay, this way you can slow the time down, or you can speed up the, the time, and you can do a whole bunch of testing. Okay, so there is come, receive, goes, escort. Okay, and then they say that disengage and move direct. Trust in, okay? Now, disengage. When we know disengage, we mean that we don't want to actually uh, engage with this guy with the force and force play or uh, a, a struggle. That is different than all this Tai Chi and all this uh, structure type of stuff. The Tai Chi Jing or force flow or push hand is, is different. The could, could tell us disengage. Meaning that he want to he if he's a Tai Chi guy he wants to do push hand we are not going to push with him. If he wants to use structure to brace us, we're not going to brace with him. We just let him go. Close in is what we want. Okay? So we don't want to play their game. So this is the issue. If you you have a simulator, you have a simulator, you know this engage mean you are not pushing it like using the Tai Chi Peng Jin, okay, to try to sustain or using the uh, 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 structure, bracing, try to, uh, to, 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 to against him or the forward pressure because those all create what? It create a reaction force and then there's no end to it as General Chi Chi Wong said. If you parry, you walk off, you withstand, then you need to have another 10 move. Just try to resolve that tangling and, and, and all this money. You don't, you just go in. You leave him, if you let him go, whatever you want, they want. You just escort him out. Okay? You receive and escort him out. That's what he said, like Lao Huizong. Come receive, go escort. You want to go that direction, you go, you leave him, you get him go. You just, you just come in. This is what you want. You're not not here playing with all this thing because we are sticking body shot strike here is what we want okay and the same thing is move in straight trust in straight then one can simulate this okay to trust in straight also one can simulate the uh, dodging to get in okay it's coming in i dodge in okay or i dodge in okay the body is very important in this go straight in and dodge in because if one do not know or have no awareness of how to handle this body, one better get the simulator, stand in the position and have a sense, aware of what the body do and how, what happened in the different situations. 
Because the body is depict the, the, the momentum as in the general Chi Chi Kuang writing, the body. Body is momentum because body is your mass. How, how do you want to play with that? How do you want to play with it? And then your foot will come with it. So the last clip of Wing Chun saying that using the, the, the heart and the soft accordingly, well, you can meet him, go direct, trust him like we, we do usually, and you can go dodging him, see what is the simple way. It's like water. If there is no, no blocking there, it just go flow straight. If it's a blocking, it goes sideways. Okay? So, would the simulator one see all this thing? And one have no longer guess and get into those, I think, I guess, I believe. Well, if you fly a Boeing 747, you don't have time to, I think, I, I believe. You're going to fly, you're going to fly, you're going to landing, you're going to land. You, you don't say, I believe, I think I can land. Can you land or not? Okay. And also, one start will be able to aware of this body. Footwork. Footwork is an empty word. Empty words. Without knowing the body. Because you don't know whether, if we don't know whether we're going to go straight or dodging in or receive or escort. We don't know how to handle this, this uh, footwork. We cannot keep in thinking, oh, Tai Chi, Peng Jing, okay, and then Li Jing, all this Tai Chi, Peng Li Chi, uh, the four Jing, and then what we are doing actually, Wing Chun, meaning that we are going to close in. And, and, and if we are thinking about Tai Chi, what we are doing Wing Chun, which is a short strike art, uh, our, our uh, technology is designed that way, how is this supposed to work? How is the step supposed to work? How is the footwork supposed to work? How is the body supposed to be handled? How is the momentum? So, I'm here again. I want to clarify. I'm not saying that Tai Chi is no good. I'm saying that different stuff. Different things have a, a manual, the body different way, the momentum different way. If we want to mix that thing, it's a chaos. That's why we need a simulator. This is a short strike simulator, the Wing Chun simulator. Whatever, when we start to do Kunjing this way, this way, you know you cannot get in. You know already, because Wing Chun, the first contact it has to go in. The first contact it has to go in. And you get to play here, okay? With the Wing Chun mechanics and also, there's no need to say, oh, so hard, I have to use this, or all this philosophy. Just follow the, 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 the instructions of the mechanics, okay? Retract, get in, because you need to have the power zone, power core to handle it. Rotate, or turn, uh, or the torque using the mechanics. And then using the action reaction force. You're just keeping playing that, and then you just saying that when whatever come you receive and you close in you play that for one week the entire thing will be different that's Wing Chun but if we keep in thinking philosophy Jing, Qi we, we don't even know if it's a Tai Chi or it's a it's a, it's a Gong Cho, it's a, it's a Wing Chun it's a White Crane, whatever how is one supposed to learn Wing Chun? It's just like, are you flying a 747 or are you flying a UFO? You cannot keep in thinking about UFO while you're flying a 747. People get killed, okay? So, this is why this is a Wing Chun fighting simulator or momentum simulator. It targeting the learning of the momentum. And this is Wing Chun. Wing Chun is not mine. Wing Chun is from the ancestor, I just show you that from the writing, you know what it is. And using the modern technology and the simulation concept and simulation tools, we get it within a week, not wasting a whole life going around the world to search, search for what? 
We just need the basic for training for one week and you got it. And then from there you can build out yourself. Everybody win. Why? Because the bottom line is that you improve your Wing Chun. You spend less money, less time. This is about education. Okay? So this is uh, to share with you today. And uh, in Wing Chun, we have to be really careful of our body, aware of the body. Because Wing Chun today is messed up with the, 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 the internal gene or those kind of stuff and techniques without knowing this body. And this is a kiss of that because when people shoot in at me, am I going to go like this grabbing him and then if they shoot in me, what kind of jing am I going to use? For the Wing Chun? Seriously? The lower forebow has to be in action. The knee is catching him to him. And how to play this? The tool and the mechanics. I'm not saying that Wing Chun solve everything, but I'm saying that today's Wing Chun practically the lower forebow is dead. How can that function? It's like a Boeing uh, 747 where half of the wing is uh, not function. How can you take off? Okay. So uh, this is for you again. I'm not some grandmaster or anything. It just apply the today's technology like flying a Boeing 747, and you see what it is. That simple. Okay. You don't need to be a rocket scientist to know this. So if you want to know what is the flying uh, the the, the uh, Boeing 747 flying simulator, go to YouTube and see how they train the. Even the uh, normal people and natural, how to fly this giant plane, which is if you crash, everybody die, okay? And it's going to fly faster than uh, the, 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 the speed of a car, okay? So, this is for you today.